Welcome back, SuicideFantasyFootball.com, week 13, as we always do, wrapping it up at the tight end position. We're, all, we're also going to throw in this week's surprise defense special teams you might want to look at. So, Jim, I'll start with the tight end, and I'm only going to name one of my two guys because I'm probably stealing yours. That's right. My first guy is Jermichael Finley. Yeah. Is that one of your guys? That was absolutely one of my guys. We said drop him. We said sit him. We've been killing him all year long. The last couple of weeks, he's actually caught some of the balls that were thrown to him. Uh, he's scored a couple of touchdowns, made a couple of decent plays. In Aaron Rodgers' offense, you're definitely looking at guys. If you're, if you're the tight, tight end, end who's yeah. looking good in Aaron Rodgers' offense, of course you're picking him up. Yeah. You got another guy you want me to throw in a second? I'm, I'm looking at Dustin Keller as well. I think he's going to be a decent play this week. Not a great play, yeah. but I don't really love the linebackers from Arizona. I think he's going to have a decent game. My other guy's Dennis Pitta. I know he's going against Pittsburgh, but this is a guy who I'd be more stashing for the playoffs. I think he could start to pick it up again. And when Flacco's home, I would be considering starting Pitta. Yep. All right, who are you sitting? I'm sitting Antonio Gates. Uh, I, I don't love the matchup this week. I think Cincinnati has pretty athletic linebackers. Uh, I think that they're going to be covering him pretty well. I love Vontez Perfect. I think he's going to have a really big impact on the game. And really, when you looked at it this past week, Gates really didn't get a lot of no. targets against the athletic linebacking core of Baltimore. So I'm sitting Antonio Gates. I am sitting Heath Miller. For the same reason we talked about running backs, wide receivers, there's almost no I shouldn't say almost no one. There's no one that's worth starting right now in the Pittsburgh Steelers, including Heath Miller. He's going to the bench. And I am dropping Martellus Bennett. I thought about dropping Martellus Bennett. He's one of those mid-range guys, but there's other guys out there I think that are going to be better options. Uh, I, I like the Redskins linebacking crew as well. I think that they're going to be covering uh, the, the tight end a little bit. Out, and I also think they're going to be keeping Bennett in a little bit. In that game, them. would you rather have Logan Paulson or would you rather have Martellus Bennett? Can I pass? <laughs> yeah, you can. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's, come on. That was the right answer. That's like saying, would, would you rather get a broken nose or kicked in the balls? Kicked in the balls. Okay. Because a broken nose. Stays forever. Stays forever. Yeah. All right, that's what we think at the tight end. So now let's throw in our defense and special teams bonus. Who are you looking at? If you need a defense and special teams pick up and play this week, who's it going to be? I changed my mind. I'm going with the San Diego Chargers. Okay. I like them at home. I think they played uh, a pretty decent game this past weekend. I know that they gave up that horrible uh, fourth and 29 to Ray Rice, but I really do think that they're going to stay in there and compete against the Bengals team that's okay. I think they're good for a touchdown. Uh, maybe not much else, but, but I like that. I got two for you. Uh, first one I am going to say is the Jets, just because they're playing against the Cardinals, and they blow. Yeah, they're going to have uh, And then I just had another one that I was thinking. You like the that. Chiefs. I do like the Chiefs a little bit. At home, in Arrowhead, against the Panthers, I like the Chiefs a little bit. And a reach, I think, for the second week in a row, I like the Rams. I think Janoris Shank against the good. Niners. Yeah, I do. I like I like him to get a defensive touchdown or a special teams touchdown. Okay, I also tell you the Buffalo Bills. Consider the Buffalo Bills too. Jacksonville, you never know. Yeah. All right, that's what we think. Tight end, wrapping it up with the defense and special teams. Hope you kick ass your last week getting ready for the playoffs. Any specific questions that you need answered, Jim at SuicideFantasySports.com, Eric at SuicideFantasySports.com. We've been helping people out all year. There's definitely some people that I feel like are going to come back at the end of the year and go, thanks, guys, for being there. You gave us some great shit. You can also tweet us on Twitter at SFFCom. Tweet us at Twitter. SFF Insider. Uh, SFF now. Insider. I'm sorry. You're right. SFF Insider. We answer all the questions that come through that way. And on Facebook, we're Suicide Fantasy Football. And don't forget to check out Suicide Fantasy Football. If you've never tried it or don't understand it, it's playing fantasy football where you pick a new roster of players each week. But once you use a player, you can't use them for the rest of the year. Genius. Pick up a free leg. Check us out so you're ready for next year. Get into a pay leg for your chance to win a trip hey, to the Super Bowl. Hey, just join for free for the last couple of weeks and yeah, check it out. Kick the tires a little bit. Yeah.